and welcome back to my let's play of Risen 3. Here on my channel, Idle Wisdom. We're here again on Kalidor. At what's his face's farm? What's your name? Ernesto. Ernesto's farm. Nope, we don't have anything to roast. And you recall last time we went to the graveyard, we were and took care of that problem for Porter returning the amulet, although although our mate here was able to talk the ghost into giving up any need for the amulet and just to rest which is which is good and we also met this farmer and the people in his farmstead and apparently his golden candlestick went missing and they've been having bad luck ever since he seems to think that the shadows appearing is the result of that but I mean that might be a bit much of a little too much of a claim but, you know, we'll see if we can find that candlestick. He thinks, perhaps, that his farmhand, whatever his name was, I don't know. The farmhand did it. But, no, oh, a teleporting stone. But the, the maid doesn't think so, but she wants... She thinks it's useful for people to think that a dude's guilty, so that she might inherit the farm, since, you know, the farmer, Ernesto, is childless. Childless. And was thinking of turning the farm over to whatever his name is, the farmhand, but now he might not. But that doesn't seem a very reputable thing to do. Who knows? That's helping someone get framed. But let's see. So we have a scatter pistol, some gold liquor. Interesting. Shows you valuable items. Some jade, parrot flight, and bloodlust. Voodoo magic. Speaking of voodoo magic and video games and what have you. Whoa. Don't get hit in the face, pal. A mate. I've been watching a playthrough of a game called Sins of the Fathers on a channel called Slail. And that's an interesting game. I never had never seen that game. It's one of those old Sierra adventure games. Not a super old one, but older still nonetheless. It's pretty wild. Has a lot of interesting stuff in it. I'm not all the way through that playthrough yet. Nicodem, that's the guy. So he says that he was out here just walking about in the, at night taking a stroll. Which is like, yeah, sure you were, pal. And he was out here on the porch. I think this is the porch. And he saw something. So does that mean one of the demon hunters stole a candlestick? Because I think that's the fortress over there. Or someone else. I don't know. Where do you think Porter took it? Since Porter walked by here as he went oh ooh, wait climb as he went to the graveyard is there anything up here what can we see well mate calm down chase edward stop jumping fool all right well i don't know hmm Cool scenery though, right? Yeah, yeah. All right, well. So I don't know wh how we're gonna find this, figure out this puzzle, but you know, we will. Most likely. Or, or we won't. <laughs> now let's see, where are we? Let's see, there's a bridge right over here. That, there's that lava flow. Last time we, a couple times ago, we went over here wanted to see hmm what was over in this area so why don't we go explore over there we're still kind of in the exploration phase of this place I need to remember what the, the buttons are I haven't played this game in a bit since last time I recorded two or three episodes and so as a result I've not played Risen 3 for a, a little while yeah, we came over here, and our mate made some overly protective comment about lava. Like, lava's doing the best he can. <laughs> Stop criticizing it. To, to Edward or whatever. Okay, yeah, over here. We fought some goblins, I think. Okay. I always thought that lava flows kind of looked like really, really hot 
scramb liquidy scrambled eggs. Oh no, that's just a oh, and that's right, our mate killed an armadillo accidentally. Oh jeez. Well, my mate, you ready? Edward, go get him. Go I'm fetch boy. That's good, I'm glad you're, you're not afraid of him because A lava golem. That would be so he's he's lava is flying out of him. I don't think he would be okay fighting this dude. Oh jeez. No get up. Woo. Very good. Good job. Man. I think we're getting pretty good at kicking Gollum's butts. Some iron uh, potion. Of essence of persuasion. Some iron ore. Iron ore. And iron ore. <laughs> 20 G. Nope, not 20 G, just iron ore. What is up here? Probably a place for Edward to get stuck. Well. Maybe later we'll come and take a look at this when we don't have someone along with us. Because, oh, he did get stuck, didn't he? Oh, no, no, no. Here, here he comes. Come on, fool. Okay, I had to check my recording. I was all of a sudden, I was all of a sudden afraid I had not actually. <laughs> hmm. Remember to. No, no, no. There we are. I was afraid I had not remembered to start recording, but I did. It's all good. Sorry, Amadillo. Didn't mean to kill your brother, or your cousin, or your best mate. It was an accident. I, I, I promise. I bet you we could fly across there with parrot flight, but... Eh. We'll do that later. <laughs> or maybe we'll find another, another way across. That would be good, too. There's some ducks. They don't really... That looks like more shadows, yes. Black ghouls. I can't see. Oh, jeez, mate. Get up, get up. Mate, you cannot attack fast enough. Flailing around this way, that way. My goodness. Dude, Dude, you suck. You suck major time. You suck terribly, dude. Get up! My control is whack freaking out. You know, mate, listen to me. Yeah, no, look at me. No, look at me. Oh, don't look away from me. Look at me. Look at me, pal. Yeah, you. No, don't look away. If you would just swing your freaking sword instead of trying to do some pirouettes or pirouettes or uh uh uh, hey, you. No, this way. Just swing your sword. Don't do flourishes, you little idiot. I'm amazed that duck is still alive, <laughs> to be honest. Man, these things attack really quickly, and our mate here just, like, he wants to, like, look. Why are you swinging around, and, and you're always taking your time? Look. You never just attack. There's a bunch of gold coins here. I wonder, I wonder if these are leading into a trap. Oh, suspicious tracks. The trail continues northeast. Do you think this is from whoever stole the candlestick? Let's go back, actually. 
We just found some tracks. Duck, you are lucky to be alive. Oh, suspicious tracks. The tracks lead further north. Whoever it was must have pretty leaky bags. <laughs> okay, there's gold. All right. Yep. We're finding gold track. All righty. You know, I just got chewed out by, by the narrator I did. Rat's like, oh, were you doing your purettes and your flourishes again instead of just farting? Well, yeah, but, you know, what's the point of winning if you can't win without a few flourishes? Well, I mean, probably don't go through as many, um, you know, as many of your provisions and healing, healing drafts. Yeah, but, I mean, what's the fun in that? And besides, I can't let the narrator get off. Let's see, okay. Her. Okay, yeah, see, there's gold right here. Is there gold? Any more gold? That's the maid. Okay, go, 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 go. Let's talk to that dude again. Nicodeme. Anything else? Nope, nope, nothing yet. Although we are finding a trail of gold coins. Nice. I was wondering how we were going to solve this, and I guess we found out. As our mate said, whoever stole this seems to have a leaky... Oh, wait, wait was that? Leaky bag. No, no, right there. Keep a sharp eye peeled, rats. You never know where danger's gonna come. Okay, so then we come right here. The tracks lead further north. Whoever it was must have pretty leaky bags. Pretty leaky bags. Do you see anyone, Duck? Yeah, I saw you and a couple and that other jackass fought in them black ghouls, I did. And black ghouls, huh? Uh oh. There's a The trail continues northeast. I think there's a hellhound over here. So careful. And there's no end to these foul creatures. You want to do something there, Edward? Sure, just stand there like a dipstick. Edward, you worthless turtle. You're never getting up again, you damn shadow. Yeah, no thanks to you. What do you mean, no thanks to me? I'm the one who struck the final blow. Yeah, well you were taking your dang time, and I was having to keep it busy, occupied, rolling around like a... <laughs> like a utter jackass. Well, yeah, but... No, never mind. Let's see. Yeah, yeah, more gold. More gold. A fire flower? Oh, jeez, there's a lot of lava right here. I think you should start taking damage slowly. Ooh. That'd be kind of cool. Oh, jeez. The tracks continue on the other side and seem to lead up the stairs. Up the stairs? Over there, huh? Hmm. All right, let's actually <laughs> let's save. This is not going to be easy. I am. Af I'm afraid I'm going to blow this. You know. Um. Okay. And then what is jump? Yeah. Okay. Haha! -ha, I can't believe I did it. Edward, how are we not dead? I don't know, but don't question it. You know, I don't want to catch on fire. And did you call these stairs? I did. The strength in numbers. A menacing Ooh. goblin. Mate, that's pathetic. Man. <laughs> Give him full props for, you know, trying. Jeez. Did 
Did goblins steal it? Oh, that barrel is moving out. Like, we stick together. Can't see a darn thing. Ah. Oh, there's a bunch of them. Ooh, there's another, like, golem or something. That's one down. Mate, you attack like a drunken pig. At last. <laughs> At last. Small, but mean. And end of a quest? A menacing goblin. Maybe these are the ones who stole the treasure. The candlestick. They're small, but mean. <laughs> All right. All right, let's go up here. I think there is a another. Oh, there's a rat. A rat. -y. All right. <laughs> Strangely enough, these are easier to to get. I would say. For our, our mate here. Oh jeez! Oh jeez! Oh jeez! Um, me. Let's let's stop drinking so much. Hit your targets. That was fun. Ooh, man, dangerous. What we get? Iron ore. All right, whatever. So. We got ancient knowledge. There's a lever right there. A hero's crown flower. And a chest. Right on. Oh, it's really easy. <laughs> Never mind. It's barely a lock. Golden clover. Some teeth. And a schematic for a carbuncle. Crystal and gold fused together by lightning. And it gives you, oh wow, a, tw <laughs> a plus 20 boost to crystal magic and a plus 10 to astral vision. Wow. That's quite a good item if you're going to be doing joining the mages. Because that's the ones who do crystal magic. I think the mages do the crystal magic. The Kila do the, oh, an engraved candle holder. There it is. The natives, the Kila, do the, the voodoo, and the demon hunters do rune magic. So, pretty cool. Alright, well, we got that. That is one mission accomplished. Let's actually save again. I wonder what is on the other side of this darn. <laughs> this darn gate. Did I save? No, let's do it again, just for, for the sake of argument. <laughs> All right. Nice. Let's see where we are, though, from here. Okay, we're back up here again. Then we can go right up. Oh, nice. Oh, and that will lead us up here. Interesting. Yeah, yeah, birds, shut your beaks. You keep your beak shut, and um, I leave you alone. Actually, you can belly ache all you want. I don't care, but just leave me. Don't tr attack me. There are is, there's a skeleton in there. You see it? I think we could kill it, but I think we should go give this candlestick back to Ernesto first. Hmm, that's quite responsible, mate. Yeah, I'm a. You know, I'm a responsible guy. Really? Since when? Well, since I got my, you know, soul yanked out of my body. Then that'd be a good reason. I, I agree. Alrighty. Well, she's not going to be too happy with us because she wanted us to let Nicodemus be framed so she would have a, actually have a chance at inheriting the farm. 
which I get why she wants to inherit the farm. Ernesta doesn't think she could do it, but not at the expense of getting an innocent man accused and disinherited, so no. I found your golden, your golden candle holder. I found your candle holder. Really? Show me. It is indeed my candle holder. Thank you. But tell me, who had it? Some goblins stole it. That's good to hear. Looks like I wrongly suspected Nicodem. I'll be able to leave him my farm after all. Thank you again. Here's a reward for your trouble. Did you give the goblins a sound whipping? The goblins won't be causing you any more trouble. Wonderful. Wonderful. Here's your reward. Thanks. All right. Well, that's nice. Nope. We'll avoid her. I don't want to talk to her now. <laughs> she won't be too pleased. And who cares? I think we don't really care one way or the other, I suppose. Where's Nicodine? He needs, he needs to know that he's out of the doghouse. Although I don't see him anywhere. Hmm. Is he maybe up here at the mill? Yes, he is. Thank you for returning Ernesto's candle holder to him. You really saved my ass. Here's a little reward for you. For your good deed. Alrighty. He's right, that was a little reward, but you know, whatever. We're not... We're not so broke that we need every last little <laughs> measly bit. We don't? No, no, we, we're doing the, the greater good, you know? Wait. You got two soul points for that. I guess so. I guess so, nothing. You got two soul points. Anything over here, or did we already look here? Anything to jump out and scare the life out of me? One more time? <laughs> Alright, let's go back up to that passageway we saw where there, there was a skeleton. Right here. Now that we've taken care of that... I want to see what's through here. Take that. Quit trapping me, you stupid skeleton. I'm impressed. All right. Got a skull. There's another skeleton. There's no end to these foul creatures. Oh, there's two skeletons, jeez. Oh, another one. Jeez. How do I block? Oh, there's that's the pistol. Block is okay, R2. What are you swinging at, fool? Come on, get him, get him. No, don't let him get you. There's always something. There's no end to these foul creatures. Nope, no, there really isn't. Oh, we got him. Beat him. Oh, that was brutal. Oh, was was Edward stomping on him? That was sick. That was cool. Oh wow, good job, y'all. <laughs> that was great. Man. This mine supplies the tools of war. Iron. There's a rat. Uh-oh, a dead miner, it looks like. Alvito. Smells as if he's been lying here for a while. Poor sod. Uh-oh, one-way trip. We got Alvito's notes. And a crossbow and some gold. Wow. Hmm. Intricate lock. Is that lock intricate, pal? Mate? No, 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 not that. Let's actually... Uh, uh, uh. Let's see, earring? I don't think so. I think it's actually um, amulet. Yvette's charm. Oh, yes, this was the... This was that ghost's 
charm that we got from her when we persuaded her to leave her attachments behind, which is kind of cool for us. Okay, we need lock picking. Here we are, crystal shard. That'll do it. Okay, this one will take a little bit of doing. Okay. No, okay. I got it. Haha. <laughs> we got a torch, some rum, some one uh, 24 crossbow bolts, and the recipe for a defense potion? Yes. Nice. Enemies will find it hard to injure you with this boost to your defenses. Nice. We'll be able to make those now. I mean, as long as we have the right ingredients, of course. Spirit mushroom. Huh. Let's go around. There's no end to these foul creatures. Come on, mate. You let him get a shot on you. Or a, a swing on you. And why do you keep impaling them? They're already dead. They're skeletons. I don't know. It's just really dramatic. <laughs> it may be dramatic, but it's kind of dumb. Eh, whatever. I don't care. I does what I does. You does what you does? Yeah. <laughs> See? I knew something would come and try to scare the living crap out of me. I hate that. Get him! Get him! Mate! Oh! Don't just shoot your gun at... <laughs> for no good reason. <laughs> Man! We got a claw. Oh, that startled me. <laughs> Jeez. They do that on purpose, I know. They know what they're doing. Alright, this is just where we were up there. Watch out, rat. Be careful. Uh-oh. No. Shade. There we are. Anybody else want to fly out of the woodwork? Or the stonework? Encyclopedia on alchemy. Here's something that looks like a hardened crab shell. I've got it already. Huh. Okay. Magic crystal. Another treasure chest. This one's pretty easy. Gold and some iron ore. Iron ore what? <laughs> dumb joke is dumb, but funny. Iron vein? Let's get some iron. That's a really unsatisfying sound, right? It sounds like he's sticking into some oatmeal or something. Not hitting a, a stone and metal wall. Okay, anything else in here? Does not look like it. Unless I've just missed something, and I think we're good. Sea charts. Hmm. So I guess, okay, so... I guess this doesn't lead to right here, but rather into underground area. So this area is from over this way. Hmm. Yeah. All right, well, we'll have to do that next time. But I think, ooh, there's another mushroom. Mushroom. All 
I think we're just about done for this episode. Maybe we'll go on a little bit more, but not too much. Right on. All right, so we're back out. Oh wait, what's that snake root? That was okay, I guess. Wasn't as cool as I thought it was gonna be. There's some more scavengers over there. Let's see, we could... See, we need to explore this ent... Wait, what's this? That's, okay, that's the brand. That's where the pig cellar was. We haven't explored this entire area right here. And all this, so we have quite a bit to explore over there. Huh, let's look at our logbook. What do we have here on Kalidor? Awesome deal! Wants to sell me a hog. Yeah, we already bought the hog there. Fool. Okay, the demon hunters are headquartered in the old citadel. I'm to pay them a visit. Realm of Shadows. <laughs> Edward's birthright. Yep, 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 yep. We need to talk to the demon hunters. We need to get Patty and Sadik. They'll join once we have a large ship. Oh, and there's this. Li Wilson. Wilson is somewhere here on Kalidor. We're still looking for him as well. I bet you he's in the Citadel, but I'm not sure. Reforge Kalidor's Coronation Sword. Reforge Wound Terror. Reforge Sphere Thorn. Heh. Jeez. Alright, well. Yeah, 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 yeah. Shut up. I'm not doing anything to you. My goodness. You guys act like I'm killing you when I'm just walking. I'm just walking. Yeah. Alrighty. Oh, there's an R O U S and a scavenger. We'll go this way <laughs> for now. I've realized that I can't really avoid fights with the R O U S's. But I can't avoid fights with the scavengers. Because the, the large rats will just come... They just barrel on after you. What are you? What is that? Is that a barrel? It is a barrel. Okay. We can do this if we stick together. Oh, there's a dragon snapper. Eat steel dragon snapper. Ow. It's like eat claws, human filth. Won't be bothering anyone now. I'd say no. <laughs> Jeez. Won't be bothering anyone now. Okay, let's see what's down here. Anything besides a scavenger? Any alligators or water lizards or what have you? Nope. Oh, there's a crystal. A rock crystal. Nice. See what else we can find down here. Man, those scavengers are everywhere. Ooh, there's that freaking what's it called? That skull spider. No end to these foul creatures. Grave spider. <laughs> hey Edward, you want to help, you idiot? Utter git. Start helping. I lost. The hell are you doing? Just standing there looking? Well, you had it well enough in hand. I don't
don't want to have a, a grave spider in hand. That's disgusting. You know, it means that you were taking care of it. Well, you're supposed to help me. Instead, you're just looking at me. I don't know, that AI is kind of crap. <laughs> I have to say. Hmm. Alright, well that's good. We saw him from the other bank. And now he's dead. He is now dead. As he should be. Yes, yes, yes. Calm down. You're fine. <laughs> no one's doing anything to you. Ooh. There's a big old monitor lizard. There's some berries. This place is really cool. I have to say. I have to say. And by I have to say, I mean I want to say again. Whoa. Yikes, that scared me. Dang nabbit. You stupid lizard. All right. What is over here? Oh, I want to go over there, but there's a bunch of animals I don't want to bother, but, you know, whatever. We'll see if we can get... Oh, there's a rhinoceros. Edward got into a fight with one of those before. Uh-oh. Oh, get up, get up, get up! There's like three of them on this island. They're mad that you're trying to take away their status as alpha predator there, mate. Come on, yo, swing your friggin' sword. Oh my gosh, dude. This, I, oh my gosh, dude, you suck. Swing your friggin' sword. What the living crap was that, mate? Utter scuzz bucket. Oh my goodness. Go, here, mate, go and thank Edward for saving your bacon. Thank you, Edward. Well, you needed the help. Well, don't get too big for your britches, Edward. You didn't help him last time when he was trying, but still. Mate, what was that? Your stupid flourishes and slow swinging and... My There's goodness. No what the heck was that? There, good. Get him. Well, that scavenger's had it. Well, stupid scavengers. Sorry. <laughs> we can have some chicken. Man. At last. We really need to get him some more training to get his his sword swinging faster. Oh, no, no, come on. You just saw what happened to your, your little buddies there, so I wouldn't be so pushy there, you stupid chicken. Man, dang. Sharp eye? Kind of takes a sharp eye to find that, I would say. Okay, there's another one of those guys right here. There's a duck. Anything else down here? This place is super cool. Alright. I think that's the, the hunters. Nope, can't go that way. That's the hunter cabin, right? Yes, it is. Yes, 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 yes. We're leaving, we're leaving, we're leaving. As long as, you know, Edward doesn't get into a fight with this rhinoceros.
All right. Well, that was in the wait. What the heck are those? Are those termites? They are. Seems Edward's blown the coop again. Oh, get moving! Mate, 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 mate! Oh, jeez. Where the heck is he? He probably got stuck. Ugh. Monitor that, you idiotic lizard. Good, good, good. Get up, get up. Got him. Haha. -ha. Take that. Let that be a lesson to all of you. Like, lesson uploaded, you're a real jerk. Alright, well. I don't know where Edward is. Probably back over there. Ugh. Let's see if we can find him. Edward, you big idiot. Where the heck is he? There you are, you jackass. Come on, dum dum. All right. Well, anyways. <laughs> I guess our mate was able to prove that he doesn't absolutely have to have help to defeat things, but still it would help but i think on that note we're going to actually call this episode we've i think made a decent bit of progress we have we solved another qu little side quest which is kind of cool but no no for there at the farm and we've fought a lot more monsters and critters and got a lot more experience um, glory as it were and i think next time we'll finish exploring this area and we'll see what this building is I don't know what that is let's see what's up in here too then after that and maybe take a look over here cross this log bridge right here and check out this observation dealie and once we're done there I think it's time for us to actually make our way to the citadel and if you recall there's that demon hunter there in the fishing village down here who will go with us to the to the um, citadel and there's also that s that demon hunter who turned himself into a skeleton who I think is over here who wants us to escort him to the citadel but I think it'd be better if we go to the citadel first with this guy over here get get our a feel for it and then come get him otherwise I don't know if that will work so I want to say thank you for joining me on this episode of my let's play of risen 3 here on my channel idle wisdom take care y'all